see this steam engine here, I don't know if Rod remembered this one, but this was a Sheringham two years ago. I'm not quite sure. Yeah, because two years ago, six days after my birthday, I went to Sheringham on the bank holiday and this engine was there. It's hard for me to remember because I can't, I can't, two years ago, I can't, probably can't remember this engine. Well you, didn't, well, you didn't come with me that time, but this is definitely the engine I actually saw two years ago. And that's actually a surprise to me when I saw it. It's amazing, isn't it? It is, yeah. I was going to say it looks a bit like Wick, but if you look at the wheel arrangement, you'll see that it isn't. Yeah, true. Look at that coach over there. Say that again, Ross. That coach over there, if you yeah. look at the writing, it says, I've been saved by the East Anglian Railway Museum. That's like Thomas and Victoria, isn't it? The book, yeah. yeah. I think it's been restored, which is, a, which is wonderful. Yeah.
on Percy's train and we're riding right on a toad here. Green light! Just got that again, eh? Green light! Oh wow! In Percy's train, yeah. above Thomas. And it's still raining again. Oh, it's been raining all day, I wish it would stop. Yeah. Well, according to the people, one of the people who work here, and it's going to be raining all day. Oh, shame, really. Well, it's not going to ruin our day, though, is it? No, not for a minute. I'm enjoying myself. Yeah, totally. I bet Toad's enjoying himself. Yes, I am, Mr. Cameraman. At least we're having a wonderful day so far, aren't we? Yes, indeed. Folks, did Ross. <laughs> Very funny. There's <laughs> <laughs> two brown carriages. And look who's in front of them. Yeah. Where's he gone? Dobber, there he is. Here you get ready for another trip. I'm really pleased that Tom's with us today. Yeah, me too. First time ever, isn't it? Yeah, Woo! Yeah. There's Daisy. Oh, oh, we just, oh, we can't see that much. Looks like Toad can't stop enjoying himself, right Toad? There he goes, Mr. Gabriel, I love you, you little bit. Mr. Gabriel, I love you, you little bit. Mr. Gabriel, you know Ross is in his Toad Force, right? Oh, on it! Yep, that. I always, when I do my Carol Jack and the voice of Ruffles, right? Ross does his Toad voice when I talk to him like this. It makes me laugh. And you? Yes, Mr. Gabriel. <laughs> It was his idea. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? Look at all those trucks. I was about to say the exact same thing. Oh look, BP. British Petrol. What is this? LMS. Yeah. There's a crane there. Toad was there last year, but I remember, well, I realised he was right there today. Yeah. And I guess we we'll had a lucky day today. Oh, there's Thomas again. Yeah, indeed. And we'll be off. And we'll be off soon. So let's pay Toad for a nice ride. Thank you very much, Toad. Thank you very much, Toad. Yeah, grab the bed. Have you enjoyed? Thank you very much, Toad. Thank you very much, Toad. It's a nice bed. Thank you, Mr. Gabby Bad, for being in the picture. Back to the shed for usual. Yeah, in the nice drive. And shelter as well. All at sea will be on when we get back inside. Mm. It might be finished by now, to be quite honest, all well, at sea. is about to go, but before we go off Thursday's train, thank you so much Tony for a brilliant ride. Yeah, too late, just to get me back. Thank you, Tony. Let's try that again. Thank you, Toad. Thank you, Toad. It's a right, man. Thank you very much, Mr. Cabinet, for letting me be in your film. It's a pleasure, like last year. Let's have a look inside too, shall we? Go on then. It'll be fun. Wow, this is 
Oh, man. Exactly, that's why they call it a break bag. Oh look, Thomas is on his way back. Hey, that's the tell Willis. Yes. It's still raining. Raining is pouring. No man is snoring. It's raining men. There's another break here. Yeah. There's one good turn as well. Hello, Joshua. Joshua. Yeah. Oh boy! There's tender engines. Just a little bit. Rich. One morning, Gordon was in the yard taking on a large supply of coal. That's a very large fellow, you've had some very good. Said James. Sure, I'll show you a bit of greedy. I'm an important dungeon, replied Gordon. If all the dungeons need plenty of coal, well, I doubt you will understand that, James. James snorted and went about his work. Oh, Thank <laughs> you. 